Paul Canaro, the Ocean Township man charged with murdering his brother, sister-in-law, niece and nephew, agreed to remain in jail to await trial in the case. Canaro appeared before a judge for the first time since the baffling murders were discovered during a fire at his brother's Colts Neck Mansion on November 20th. Within the jurisdiction of this court, you did purposely or knowingly cause the death of Keith Canaro or serious bodily injury resulting in the death of Keith Canaro. At this point, we acknowledge that my client has been served in regards to these particular complaints and ask that a not guilty plea be entered in regards to all of these complaints. Mr. Uh, Canaro, is anyone forcing you to waive this pretrial detention hearing? No. Are you under the influence of any drugs or alcohol today? No, I'm not. Robert A. Honecker Jr., who is Canaro's attorney, explained that they waived a detention hearing because the chance of a person charged with four counts of murder being released is practically zero. But for this particular uh, proceeding, it was uh, our view that it was best to move on to what the next challenge is, and that is to defend uh, Mr. Canaro in a court of law. Nonetheless, Honecker entered not guilty pleas on Canaro's behalf. For more on this and all the developments in this case, turn to app.com. This is Kathleen Hopkins at the Monmouth County Courthouse in Freehold.